Hey guys, Autumn of Inquires here. So, like I did a video on the new Outback that I have. Um, and of course, we always do up a nameless on there. So there is your stock mufflers. Um, I always do the five inch. So this is gonna be just a quick install type video. So again, nameless performance. They don't sponsor me, they don't pay me. I love their products. So I like to give them a kudos. So, unboxed it. Same quality as always, very nice. Clean welds, these things look great after a couple years. No tips on this one, this one sits back underneath the bumper. So, basically, long story short of it is, <coughs> you're gonna need 14 mil socket and a 14 mil box end wrench, no big deal. Same as the other ones. We're gonna provide you this new hardware. <coughs> you can choose to use it if the bolts are too short, you can decide for yourself. Now, unlike the Impreza's, this one has a lip here, so we're gonna to need to use their exhaust gasket to seal it flat, because again, the uh, new mufflers are smooth. So, I already removed it, so again, I always tell you, you're gonna want some heavy duty silicone in the garage. The reason why you're gonna use this under your car is because eventually it dries, um, it's not, greasy, it's not sticky, it's not gooey. And uh, the car is about 4,000 miles on it, so we, uh, you know, there was a little bit, of, not an issue breaking the bolts loose or whatever, but these hangers were kind of stiff. So while they're up there with the muffler on there, go ahead and spray this piece right here with silicone, and then literally, probably for the next day or two, I mean, they slide right off. You're not even gonna need to do that now. This silicone versus like a petroleum distillate type lube like WD-40, that can eat rubber. So we don't want these things loose indefinitely. We just need them loose for a minute. So what we're gonna do is I'm gonna get these bolted up. I got the other one dropped off. Why it's under the car. Again, I left these ones on to show you. They're identical. But instead of, you can spray both, it doesn't really matter, but spray this and uh, push this back a little bit and spray that um, tip piece on there that's flanged and then literally you'll be able to just push that right off there with your finger and then you can slide these off if you need to because you'll need to install them on the original you reuse your rubber hanger so um, so far this part took me about eight nine minutes the uh, system that I got is dual so I can't hold the camera and do it all at one time so I'm gonna get these bolted up and then I'll do a sound video the stock exhaust basically made no sound. Um, these I anticipate will make some drone and, and lots more sound. Uh, but again, very good quality, very simple installation. Uh, remove the bolts, pull the other exhaust out. Always save your, ex your stock exhaust, always save your bolts. So if you don't like sound, you can reinstall them. Uh, very, very pleased with the quality of this. And I'll get this one posted. If you have any questions, feel free. Um, but it really is unbolt and bolt back. Um, and just laying the pieces there you can figure out which one goes to what so you will need to use the exhaust gasket on this one So see you in a minute dudes